Si c'est ça la question. overloaded or what yeah it just it, when i first bought it it worked great but then ever since then it doesn't have the power or something so it stops a lot sometimes Do you think it went about a half inch? Huh? Yeah. That's good. That's all you gotta do. Right, let's, let's do the build the one. See that perfect that is? Let me pick this up and put it over here. <clears throat> so see. So now. See, that's perfect. You think so? And watch. Now it's going to line up. Flip it. Oh, shoot. It's this one. Well, aren't you going to shave it a little? Yeah, I can clean it up. Okay. I was just kind of trying to get it as close to it. So it's could, but, big enough for water flow. But look at the original one would have been right here. Which is not good, right? Way off. And it's then look how close, close it is to the... Close, yeah. But no, no, no. As long as it's like the one that... The other one. Yeah, yeah. And th this lines up with the intake. I know, but the, your old head? Yeah. This is what... That's where they have theirs. That's where I got the measurement. And I would do it just like the other head. Because yeah. that one worked. That was hard to see in there. It does look like it has a little groove, though. But yeah. It doesn't, though, you feel. And then we just have to seal the, the old water ports. Just show it you did see it's uh 
make sure that it's in about a half, maybe an eighth of an inch, I'm sorry. Just to hopefully not have to resurface the heads. We'll see. Yeah, okay. Here's that. Yeah. Alright guys, we're getting ready to weld. And this is practicing. what I got for the practice. Yeah, Ryan's gonna practice. But this is the the rods that I got for the cast iron. They're from Muggy Weld LLC. Yeah. 77 cast iron video. electrode. That's what is recommended. What's up guys, it's my 14 subscribers. <laughs> so we're back. We did uh, the modifications. We welded those, those uh, water ports and then opened up the, the new ones. So we're good to go. But I wanna make sure that I don't have to put any kind of, um, um, RTV or or whatever so I'm gonna see if those seals actually worked what did I say those welds so I just used a little bit of um this little like play-doh looking thing pushed it down on the surface real good to make sure that that the surface seals and then I'm just gonna leave it here for a little bit so guys welcome back so we got the heads back and they're ready to go uh, now we just gotta work on the oil pan water pump and do a bunch of stuff before we get the car up and running so I'm gonna spare you guys from all that work there's plenty of videos out there showing you how to do it so I'll just do a quick time lapse but Hopefully the next video, it'll be putting the car back together and going for a drive. <laughs> 